On today's demonstration, I have a 4G LTE modem plugged in by USB straight into the Devado 4GR router uh, on the front side there. And on the back of the router, I have an Ethernet cable that goes into my laptop. And I should be doing an unconventional form of speed test using a tool uh, called an FTP client. And that will do a file download off the internet and we measure the speed based on how much is coming in etc. So um, to measure the speed I'm using a, a program called DU meter and they have a really nice little uh, tool embedded inside it called the uh, stopwatch and you can measure the speed that uh, the maximum speed the average speed and the current speed so I'll now do a file download using an FTP client there's a public server which I'll access. I'll take a one gigabyte file, right click it, and I'll go to multi-part download in eight parts. This means that I'm chopping the file into eight different streams because some operators uh, have a speed cap per stream. And if you, if you pair up all the streams together, you're maxing out the full capacity of that connection. So I'll take eight parts, and the file is now beginning to download. And if we enable the stopwatch, start, you can see the speed there. The maximum transfer rate is 81.9, average is 55, and current is 51. Now watch this. This modem is sitting at this angle. If I'm going to rotate it around the clock like this, you can see the current transfer speed is affected as I rotate it. There we go. 91.7 was the peak there. And a little bit. Of, okay. Found an angle there. And if I lower the modem a little bit, what happens then? Will it improve or will it get worse? Yeah. Put it back up again. There. That seems to be holding well. At 90 megabits. So that's the angle to get 90 megabits out of the 4GR. Whoops, 92, more like it. Thank you. Bye bye.